Peggy 18. Anything? Still living up to her name. How about you drop the act? Who infected you with a parasite? We can't let her talk. Put it back. All I want's a name. That won't trigger anything. Tell me. Tell me! Your lungs have been barbecued. There's traces of rubbing alcohol in your alveoli. This was found adhered to your lungs, intact. A petal, white star of Bethlehem. The hospital. Skullface sent you to Cyprus to kill Snake. You were burned inside and out. That should have been the end of it. But, all things considered, you look pretty damn healthy to me. We have Skullface to thank for that, right? I was the only one capable of applying them to parasite therapy. Until he stole them from me. Why are you here? Did Skullface send you? Or did you have your own score to settle with the boss? <laughs> Refreshing? Salt water. No! She'll die! His life isn't yours to take. Enough! That's enough. If she wanted to kill the boss, he'd already be dead. Same goes for us. She's had plenty of chances. She can talk. She's not here to kill anyone. You're wasting your time. It doesn't matter why she's here. She works for you now. 
She's in love with the legend. What makes you so sure? I was the same way once. What if she's a spy? What if I'm a spy? Are you? Go on all day. Boss, let her go. She won't speak, so she can't spread the infection. <laughs> The death is odd. Belagana Gesnita Kato Be Yasteta Asetota Dotonista. It's raining.
Nine years ago, this man acted as accomplice to the attack on Motherbase. He then provided support to Skullface. Conspiring with Eli, he repaired Sahelanthropus in secret. His research materials caused the leak at the quarantine facility, which in turn caused the Walbachia mutation, letting the parasites off their chains. We lost a lot of good men. He also stands accused of murdering one of his own family, hiding the body. I haven't killed anyone. The rest is all wrong, too. The inspection was supposed to help everyone. I sacrificed myself for my companions just as much as any of you. Why won't you believe me? The prosecution calls a witness. <laughs> Love's gravestone, haunted by her phantom. It's just a machine. Huey! Damn it, Huey! Open it now! Please, let me out! Kill me! Kill it recorded it all. Everything. Everything you did living together. How could a machine... You forced your own son into the cockpit of a Metal Gear. A test subject. How? His mother had to hide him away. And for that, you locked her in that coffin. No! She... she did it herself! It was suicide! And even if I did, what right do you have? There's more. We have you to tell us everything you've done. Everything you've thought. All this time. Nine years ago, you agreed to the inspection in return for Cypher's guarantee that you'd be spared. I thought it was real! We've reviewed into everything else that's happened since you arrived here. Please. Guilty! All counts. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! We exist outside the law. What should we do, boss? Just give the order. We'll handle the rest. Prepare a life raft. Big enough for one. Food and water, too. Boss. He's leaving. You... He's responsible for... For all of this! Think of all the men! He didn't lose a damn thing! This is the enemy! And he's here on his knees! Us. You are right. He is not one of us. But we are not responsible to judge an enemy. He leaves Mother Base, and that'll be the end of it. Trying to save you all! 
How can you do this? Am I the only sane one here? I... My... It's not my fault! Look. You can't discard your phantoms forever, Doctor. Son of a bitch will make it, you know. I can see it now. In no time, he'll be telling tales about the black-hearted Diamond Dogs. The shining white knight, blabbering on about our injustice, hiding behind his fool's idea of morality. And all the other fools will stand around, nodding with every word he says. No. One day he'll see through the lies he's built up, realize what kind of man he really is. What goes around comes around. You can't run from yourself forever.
Quiet.
The boss is with me. Ahab? Wait, who is this? Identify yourself! There's no time! Hurry! Where are you? What is your location? No, you're moving away from us. Circle back to your 8 o'clock. Copy that. Guide me to your location. Proceed to your 10 o'clock. Understood. Come back towards your 1 o'clock. Copy. 1 o'clock. Shift slightly to your left. Now proceed straight. 1.5 miles. Slide right. A little more. Yes, there you go. One more mile. Strong winds approaching. Quick, adjust to your right. Hold your position and proceed straight. Half a mile to go. <sighs> Pequod, I can see you. I have a visual. There you are, Ahab. Visual confirmed. <sighs> Pequod, hurry! This way. You're... I didn't know you could be so talkative, quiet. <laughs> the boss is here. Hurry, Pequod. Please! Boss! Boss! I gave you an anti-venom. Where's Quiet? I... We've gotta go.
Let's go, boys. has been updated. I did not choose to be quiet. I wanted to express my feelings to you. If only we shared a common tongue. Vengeance was what drove me to them. The only language left to me, revenge. But the words we shared, no, that was no language at all. That is why I chose the language of gratitude instead and go back to silence.
When all 